In this video, we are going to see how to connect Arknix 2 channel Wi-Fi retrofit switch module. So this module has 6 terminals here. So you could see uh, L2, L, L1, N, S1 and S2. So basically irrespective of which channel modules, L and N are the inputs to the modules. So L comes as a live from your main board, like you know from uh, the live from the switch board and N is the neutral from the switch board. So these two are the input connections, are the only input connections to the module and the rest all are going to be the output connections from the module. So what I've done, I've taken uh, these uh, four plastic channels here, so which has metal inside. So I just connected uh, the neutral from the switch board to here so this is the input neutral and i have shorted this so that all these four terminals act as neutral so similarly what i have done i have done the same for live as well so i have taken the main live i have connected this to, to this module and i have shorted this so all these four uh, terminals act as live so as i said i am going to give live and neutral to the module so i have taken one red wire from here so you could trace back so this goes to the module here so i taken one red wire and given SL to this module and similarly i taken one black wire from the neutral and given SN to this module so the live and neutral connections are over so now we will go to L1 and L2 connections so L1 and L2 these two are the connections to the appliances the appliance could be uh, your light or fan or even socket which you are trying to control using this module so the live goes from here from L1 and L2 so for this video I'm going to use this yellow bulb and the red bulb so yellow color wire is the live to the yellow bulb and red color wire is the live to the red bulb so what I'm going to do I'm going to connect uh, the yellow wire to L1 which is corresponding to S1 switch and uh, the red color wire to L2 which is corresponding to S2 switch so let's give that connection Now I had given the yellow wire to L1 and the red wire from this red bulb to L2. So these two are the appliances out. The remaining two terminals are S1 and S2. So these two goes to the switches. So this is where the main confusion would arise. And for any switch modules, I would recommend to remove all the you know wire, existing wiring connections from your switchboard. So I have taken a switchboard which has four switches in it, uh, marked as one, two, three, and four. So right now I'm just going to use one and two. So what I have to do, I have to give this S1 to first switch which is one and S2 to second switch. So like previously we have mentioned, S1 is going to control the L1 L1 appliance which is the yellow bulb and S2 is going to control the red red uh, color bulb so which is the L2 appliance right so I'm just going to give those connections you can give it to either side of the switches right that doesn't matter So now I had given uh, the S1 and S2 wires to switch 1 and 2 respectively. So the other side of the switch should be live. So this changes for you know 1 and 2 channel and 3 and 4 channel. So for 1 channel and 2 channel the other side of the switch should be given live. For 3 and 4 channel the other side of the switch should be given neutral. So I'll repeat that again because this is really important. For 1 and 2 channel module you have to give S1 and S2 on one side. The other side should be live. And for 3 and 4 channel you will give S1, S2, S3 and S4 on one side. The other side should be neutral. So this, since this is 2 channel module I'm going to give live connections to these two terminals. Okay, so now I had given the live connections as well. So these two are S1 and S2 and these two are the live connections that you can see the red wire uh, from this uh, from this plastic module right here as you can see. So now we can turn on the main and we can see if, if these switches are controlling the lights. So switch 1 should control yellow and switch 2 should control the red one. So I'm going to turn on the main power. 
So as you can see, both the lights are on at the moment. I'm turn, trying to turn this one off. This one should turn off the yellow light. Okay, it's done. And I'm turning off the red one as well. So it's working. So I'll just turn on, on again. Yellow is turned on, red is turned on. So that's pretty much it. Simple connection. Thank you.